this is a place that can get really messy. It's chaotic and we don't get in each other's hair about it too much. Like I think that actually is a pretty nice thing about this shop and how it runs. We have a shop point person. The shop point person is sort of the person you go to if there's some issue, if there's something in the way. We also all have shop jobs. You know, the weld shop like has a few like real champions. So they organize the space and they take care of the equipment in there. Then we have weekly meetings after our shop cleanup. I'll be on a project. We have content developers and scientists who are working on the project and ideas get thrown around and then you latch on to the ones that seem like you could imagine them being exhibits and that are interesting to you. Things that are simple are usually really great. We're the ones maintaining the exhibit, so we know a lot about what wears out and how things wear down and what problems can happen. Just have to, you know, come up with systems like have spare parts or have easy ways to take things apart. Don't make it so that you have to destroy the exhibit in order to replace one part. What you end up making really depends on what skills you have. I get by without needing to use the table saw. Like, you know, like it just means I make a different kind of exhibit. And I think that kind of diversity is actually really nice. Yeah. Though sometimes it's inconvenient if right. you can't use a table saw. Right. <laughs> <laughs>